U.S. warfighters will be safer while flying into contested airspace thanks to training provided by a new simulator system built by the Georgia Tech Research Institute. The Advanced Radar Threat System, Variant 1, will be used on training ranges to simulate how defensive systems on fifth-generation aircraft interact with a variety of modern radar systems used by other nations. Gaining experience with the radars and practicing responses to the threats are part of training that helps air crews improve survivability and increase combat effectiveness. The threat simulator was built for the ARTS V-1 program office at the Air Force Life Cycle Management Center. The simulator uses an electronically scanned phased array antenna and can operate on a wide range of frequencies and with different waveforms. Carried on two large tractor trailers, the 142-ton system is designed to be moved around ranges as needed. The first ARTS V-1 system was delivered to the Air Force in June 2023. Two flights of a C-5M Super Galaxy, the Air Force's largest aircraft, were required to transport the system from Atlanta. Practicing response tactics under a broad range of conditions will help air crews respond better in real combat situations. This new simulator will help the Air Force meet these training needs. In Atlanta, I'm John Toon with the Georgia Tech Research Institute.